Hello, I'm Kenny McMillan, and welcome to Tool Talk. Today on Tool Talk, we are talking about the bright tangerine left field cage for the C500 Mark II. I actually own this C500 Mark II, so I was excited to get my hands on what appears to be one of the first, if only, cages uh, for this camera. Now, depending on what level of production you're at, you may need um, more or less equipment. But what a cage does is it'll it gives you many mounting points, hopefully, that allow you to attach, you know, monitors, cine tape, video transmission, and other wireless nonsense. Um, there's a lot of stuff that get, ends up getting put on a cinema camera. A cage gives you all those mounting points as well as support for rails, hopefully. A good cage should have support for rails, otherwise there's much less point. Rails allow you, obviously, to mount follow focus like I have here, um, matte box, lens support. If, if you have long enough rails, you have them coming out the back, you can put um, battery plates, other transmission stuff. Uh, with these top rails, actually, you can put, I would put like a focus motor up there. Maybe your, your monitor's attached in an interesting way. Now, cages are cages, but the two key features of this one are the slidable top handle here, which for the C500 is kind of important because if you put the uh, adapter module on the back and you put a V-lock on it, it's going to become more back heavy. So uh, you can scoot that back or forward if you've got a big lens and no back, you know, whatever you need. And the open up base plate here at the bottom, which allows you to attach this to any Ari style dovetail, even ones that are out of spec because there's a little bit of flexibility here. You unlock it and then that way you can scoot it forward or back. But if you need to, you can unlock it more and it'll just come right off instead of needing to slide it or anything. And apparently this is the only cage that does that. So that's pretty nifty. There are three packages that Bright Tangerine sells uh, of this cage. The base model uh, includes the open up base plate, the top plate and the top handle, which includes this uh, monitor bracket here to put on the original C500 monitor bracket just in case you don't want to use a cine arm like I have here. And that pretty much sets you up for most shoots. You've got your low rails, you've got your high rails, you've got all your little mounting points and your top handle. The advanced package includes the dovetail. So if you don't own one, uh, obviously Bright Tangerine makes their own. The plate that holds the top handle on top is the same plate that you can put on the bottom here and uh, attach normal tripod plates or whatever you need, now you've got all these uh, mounting holes on the bottom. And I don't know why you would do that beyond a tripod, but heck, mount a, you know, maybe maybe you're shooting a vertical video for web with your 6K raw camera, and you need to mount a handle to the bottom, you know? So there you go, that's, that's one reason right there. Um, speaking of handles, the expert package uh, includes this uh, 3 8 inch rod mount with the safety pin or with the yeah safety pins which all of these 3 8 ports like i said have it also includes the side plates and the 12 inch drumsticks one thing about the drumsticks is they are titanium i personally own uh carbon fiber ones obviously because they're light they're strong whatever but i've got to tell you these titanium drumsticks are very 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 well these are going to be very light because they're like three inches long, but uh, the 12 inch ones are incredibly light, either as light or lighter than my carbon fiber ones. And they're incredibly durable, uh, it's titanium, so those are nice. As I was speaking about handles, I will say that one thing I look for in a cage is a side plate, because on the left side, if I'm going handheld, I want to be able to attach a handle. On this recent fashion shoot that I did, I shot all this handheld, I was uh, attempting to put together a pretty rough test of this camera, you know, trying to go no raw in the blistering sun, handheld with an anamorphic lens, double focusing, you know, making it as hard for myself as possible to see what kind of image I could still get out of it. I actually had to focus with my fingers because it was an old Nikkor lens. So yeah, those are the goods and bads of the C500 Mark II cage from Bright Tangerine. I know I just said goods and bads. There are no bads. It's a cage. <laughs> it's also very light. It's only a kilogram, which is like 30% lighter than their C200 cage. All in all, during my shoot day, uh, loved running this cage. Real nice. If you're in the market, go for it. Um, you can get it at Film Tools.